Alrighty guys, welcome back to Minecraft Story Mode, where today we are continuing where we left off here in Episode 3. Sorry, I'm just checking my gain and making sure it's, uh, you know, set properly for the video. And yeah, let's just get started here. Let's look around, see if there's anyone we can talk to. There's someone over there. Is there anybody over here? Okay, let's start with the poster over here and we'll work our way around. Sunshine poster, it's changed. You know, the name of the place has sun and shine in it. And this place doesn't have either. I guess zombie this is supposed to represent the, a zombie words. level, the zombie mines. There's a zombie spawner right there. A uh, hole in the wall. Hey, what is this? Oh, the big guy, Oxblood, was down for a while and headbutted the wall. Not sure why, but man, he has a hard head. We just haven't fixed it yet. There's redstone behind the wall. Hmm, I wonder what it connects to. That has something to do with it. I bet it's a, a puzzle. Let's look at the door. Gotta be a way in, but this door won't budge. Hey, don't even bother trying to get in. See those item frames? Only the admin and the warden have the right items. And they could be anything. Besides... Why would you want into Prisoner X's cell? That's just bonkers. Stay away. Just gonna stare at her blankly. Just keep clear of it. Hmm, so that redstone leads to this door. If I can bypass the redstone circuit, I can open the door. What I need a lever. Down here? We couldn't leave you by your lonesome. So, so we you guys in trouble and got ourselves sent down too. You We're in this together. So we stick together. You guys rock. I'm so glad to see you. Almost as glad as we are to see you. What did you find? We need to find something to bypass a redstone circuit and get this door open. This will lead you us know to what? X. She can help us. If you and your friends good. do something Jesse, do stupid, no at least you did X's. it together. <laughs> There is someone in here who came from the outside who may still have a hefty inventory. Ah, oh, Stella. Let's talk to Radar. Hey, Radar, you okay? That mushroom... It was... intense, huh? No kidding. Standing up to the warden, though? That's my Jesse through and through. Thanks, buddy. I didn't Those stand up to the prisoners. warden. I did what he told me no to do. food? Rough stuff. And Stella? Here? We can't catch a break. But first things first. Let's find this Prisoner X and get out of here. Well, she's right through that door right there. Um, there was a, somebody over here that we could talk to. Oh, hey! Uh, you want some? Fresh flesh! Wow, you really like that stuff, huh? Nah. Oh? I love it! High in protein, high in flavor, maybe just a little bit poisonous sometimes, but you only live once. You sure you don't want some? I'm good. I need to go around you. Yeah, no, I'm good. Your loss. <laughs> Okay, that's, uh, that's gross. Minecart track. Let's look at this. All those minecarts bringing the zombie flesh somewhere. What could the admin want with it? Why would you need zombie flesh? I got a feeling I got to go talk to Stella over here in her office. Jesse, you can't keep socializing with your guest friends over there. It's bad form. Gross. Yeah, uh, about that. I uh, need your help. I need to make a lever. Pronto. Why exactly? Not that I, you know, really care. 
That's probably stupid. Do you want the truth? I'm trying to escape. As much as I admire you actually telling the truth, there's not a creeper's chance in a cat pack. Not helping you here. No, not risking angering the admin. I had to really prove myself to get this gig as it is. Not giving it up for you. He's just using you. How can you not see that? No, uh, it's uh, mutual. We're, you know, using each other. I think. Maybe you make some good points, but not enough of them. I have a place here. Respect. Uh, you know, a power and the, yeah, the works. It's actually very prestigious. Many, many people would love to have this position. Yeah, but what about Champion City? You're gonna abandon them? <laughs> Absolutely not. They'll be fine. They will be just, oh yeah, who am I kidding? I have done so much for them in the past, I mean, they can barely make bread without me supervising. Okay, look, maybe this isn't my dream destination. This place is horrible, and I am worried I will never get the smell out of my hair. Here's the cobblestone and stick. But you need to get me out of here. I know we've had our issues, but I also know that you're a Fine. hero or whatever. Uh, sure. Just this Stella, once. Be happy to have you. If you're happy, I'm happy. Just because you gave me the stick and the lever and you admitted that to come back to you levers. did something wrong. Somewhat. You admitted this might have been a bad decision. Okay, let's do this. Oh no. Wait, this would probably be the best time. Okay, we gotta get some stamina. Torch. It works. Pull it! They're gonna snitch. It's the admin! What? Oh, of course. Of course it's Jesse. Why am I not surprised? Admin? The warden told me you were zooming up the associate ladder. Now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mine? What gives? I don't know if you're dense or what, but working somewhere usually means you don't do things to actively destroy where you work. Hang on, Admin. It's just a misunderstanding. Let's just talk this out. Misunderstandings? Oh, we are way past misunderstandings. Way past. <laughs> Admin! Sir! I'm very disappointed in you, Warden. I I'm just, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just a nervous eater. I'm sorry. No, no, not that. Your star guard, Jesse, is nothing but a saboteur. You were my greatest hope. You were moving up the ranks, 
And now you've ruined me. I thought you were following in my footsteps, trying to reform. Was that all... all lies? Yeah, sorry about that, Warden, but you kind of work for a terrible person. He doesn't deserve an apology, Jesse. Oh, for the love of... Enough! I'm through letting you disappoint me. And that goes for you, and you, and you, and especially you. And as for you... I've been looking for an opportunity for you to prove your loyalty. To prove your worth as my champion. Oh no. So, unless you want to be added to my naughty list, I suggest you pull out your sword and attack Jesse. And as for you, Jesse, well, don't think I don't believe in fair play. <laughs> oh, so he's going to make me fight now Petra. Real fun. No! What do I do? Do I just go for it and attack Petra? I had such high hopes for you, Jesse. The highest of hopes. You could have been my champion. You gave it all away. This is not good. Petra, what are you doing? I'm so sorry, Jesse. Are you afraid, Jesse? I'd get over it quick if you are. No, I can't. This isn't happening. Serious? Ouch! Zip it, Jesse. We only got one shot at this. I'm gonna go to the admin, and then we'll both attack him. Just trust me on this one. I think he knows. I think he knows everything. And yep. <laughs> you're, you're joking, right? That's your big idea. Swords can't hurt me. Uh oh. Uh oh is right. All I asked you to do is fight your friend to the death, and you can't even do that. I don't even want you to be my friend anymore. And I don't want you to be my friend either. In fact, as far as I'm concerned, this whole place can burn to the ground. What about Prisoner X? What about all of us? The Institute remains inescapable. So what do I care? I'm leaving. And I'm never thinking about any of you ever again. Guess I'll just be my own friend now. Can't dwell on the setbacks. Gotta keep looking forward. What are you doing? This isn't how you make friends. Oh, I think I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm gonna have loads of friends soon. After all. Everyone loves Jesse, right? No. He's gonna be running around with my face on. No way. You coming? God dang it. I got your back, Jesse. Trust me. I take care of Luna for me. Coming, darling admin. You know what? Just this well, once. It's just the beginning. Just Your this once. Just, fall in line just this second Lucas, time. Axel, Olivia, all of them. Don't worry. I'll take good care of Beacon Town. <laughs> Gone. Jesse, we gotta stop him. Oh, Petra. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so, 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 so sorry. What? 
No, you have nothing to apologize for. You did everything you needed to. You survived. Let's hope Prisoner X is really our ticket out of here. She better be. Oh, I'm so glad you're all right, Petra. Hmm. Yeah, that was... That was pretty bad. After he took me away, I, I was in this weird place. Time and everything was so strange. I felt like I'd been there forever, and I started to worry you'd given up on me. Hmm. Petra, are you crazy? We would never give up on you. Yeah, what Jesse said. Hey! Well, that's a nice thing for you to say. I saw Beacon Town, Jesse. They were all worried about you. No one knew where you were or if you were alive. I'm sure the admin's heading there right now. Wearing Jesse's mug to boot. It's freaking messed up, yo. It's true. Identity theft is no joke. Admin will wish he had never even seen my face when I'm done with him. Jack's no one Jack's joke. Identity theft is no joke. We made it. Wow. Did we though? So it's me, a villager, yeah, and a llama. Security. Just stick close to Jesse, all right? Mm. We'll be fine. Don't worry. Yeah, you guys go on. Get Prisoner X. Hmm. Are those bars red, or is it just the way they look because of the red filter? The prisoner X. That's where I'd or the it. red haze, not red filter. Sorry. I think that's where we need to go. We got this. Okay, now all we have to do is cross this conduit, reach the platform, jump down, and not die. Mm. Come on, I think we can make that jump. We so can, let's do it. You're up next, Nerm. Get him! Okay, we got him. Okay, now you loon. This llama is a parkour master. Do that. Last jump. Geronimo. Um... Don't, don't. We hit a pressure plate. I heard it. Whoa! Who are you? I'm Jesse. You must be Prisoner X. <laughs> Bold of you to come here, not knowing who you're dealing with. I could shove you right into that lava. And you deserve it for being so trusting, so gullible. Just one little push. <laughs> and sizzle, sizzle, sizzle! I'm not your enemy. You don't need to threaten me. Yes, but it's so much fun to threaten you. I don't get much fun these days. Look, Prisoner X... Zara! You're supposed to know how to get out of here, right? What? Where did you get that idea? Oh. No one's ever escaped the Sunshine Institute. You try to escape all the time. Why would you do that if you didn't know the way out? I get bored from time to time. I like to stretch my legs, beat up a few guards. It doesn't mean a thing. 
The admin stole my identity and he's running around with my face doing horrible things in my name. I gotta get out of here now. Romeo was here? Just now? Well, Romeo? Uh, the admin was, but who's... Romeo. That's his real name. You didn't think admin was his given name, did you? He would want you to think that. Of course he would. How do you know his real name? Oh, we're very old friends. I know his real name, and much, much more. You must really be something if you made him so mad. He almost never comes down here in person, except to put the warden's feet to the fire from time to time. Well, there is no more warden. The admin fired him. That's fantastic. We won't have any trouble escaping with that little creep out of the picture. So now you want to help Any me? enemy of Romeo is a friend of mine, I always say. Well, I've never technically said that. But I think it sounds pretty good. Oh, so glad you changed your mind. Oh, you changed my mind, Jesse. You're obviously a formidable ally. But don't forget, you do need me. I'm the only one who knows the way out. You know the way? Then show me. Let's get out of here. Just one problem. This whole room is rigged to explode if I step one foot out of it. Explode? Take a look around. If someone doesn't stand on at least one of these pressure plates on the floor, these sticky pistons will retract. Lava meets TNT. And then the whole place blows up before you can say kaboom. <laughs> That's a stone pressure plate. That means I can't just use a block. Oh, it's fine. One of your silly companions can stay behind. The rest of us can go. That's the situation. That's the only way out. We're all getting out of here. No one's staying behind. Oh, I'm afraid that's quite impossible, Jesse. One of them is going to have to stay. Oh, I hate to be a wet slime about all of this, but we have to get moving. I can't just leave them here. Then just leave one of them here. As long as one pressure plate is stood upon... They're gonna the make me actually leave one the here? The like, the, I'm actually gonna have to live someone behind. here? Nerm, no, you can't do that. Is Nerm just oh, volunteering? We seriously don't have time for this. I'm leaving. If you're interested in escaping the Sunshine Institute alive, I suggest you do the same. Okay. You know what? Nerm's an adventurer. He was willing to offer himself to stay behind. We're gonna go with Nerm. We're gonna bring Luna. I'm sorry, L Nerm. But you chose. Sure about this, Nerm? <laughs> Stella did ask me to look after her. Come on, Luna. We gotta go. I promise we'll be back for you. No man left behind. How did you... My straitjacket? Oh, that was the easy part. If you're done with your tearful goodbyes, we have a prison to escape from. Oh, we can see him in the glass. I'm sorry, Nerm. Oh, uh, Prisoner X, I presume? Yeah, guys, this is Zara. Zara, the guys. Hello. Where, uh, where's Nerm? Oh, your villager friend offered to take my place so my cell's booby traps wouldn't go off. <gasps> what? No. He... he did that? And you let him? Zara knows how to defeat the admin. We'll come back for him when this is all over. Yeah, if there's still a Nerm to come back for. <sighs> well, no matter what it takes, no matter how many heads I have to clobber, I will get him back. 
She better be worth it. Trust me, I'm worth it. Ugh, can we get going, or is the reunion still underway? Yeah, we're going, we're going. Come on. Run for your lives! The guests have escaped their lounges! The warden's been fired! <laughs> Zombie meat is back on the menu! When I find that warden, I'm gonna make him pay for what he put me through! Yikes. Um. Wouldn't want to be the warden right now. Every prisoner in this place wants to tear him to pieces. He better yeah. watch his back. And his front, and his side. Yeah. What about the one guy the I made mad at I'm me? I'm about the guy. Whatever happens won't be pretty. Well, the one I psychologically scarred by, like, cutting the mushrooms yeah. off of his cow. Not gonna be nice. <laughs> Let's see if they left us any weapons. Weapons! Sweet, sweet weapons! Petra goes a little crazy for weapons. Are those our I swords? Take the enchanted iron sword or the diamond sword with no enchantment. The diamond sword will last longer, but the iron sword is enchanted with sharpness. Not bad, hmm. Diamond one. Let's just go with the diamond one. Okay, definitely feeling better with a sword in my hand again. Agreed. She's got poisonous arrows. It's versatile. I don't know much about llama fashion, but that's a good look, Luna. Oh, he has an Order of the good Stone gang. Shield. You, know you jerks better not have taken all the cool weapons before I got to dig through them. Friends reunited. It's a prison miracle. Even if Jeff is a little uh, completely different. Mm. I ought to pound you to pulp for what you've done to Jeffy Boo. Incoming face punch! Look big, red, and ugly. Maybe you should reconsider your emotions right now. Prisoner X, oh jeez, I don't want no trouble. I'm out of here. Come along, Jeffy. That was frighteningly effective. Well, now that that's over with, can we get moving now, please? Okay, I thought that would be uh more climactic. The opening should be just around this corner. Oh, we have a situation here. Back! Back! All of you! One more step and it's Kaboomsville! Jesse! Hey! You're wearing a guards outfit! Well, guards ain't in charge no more! And furthermore, I'm not a fan of guards! So thusly, you're getting beat up a bunch. Oh boy. Well, dip my bristles. Look who it is. It's my happy little friend who took a look at my happy little painting. Jesse, you freed prisoner X? Just when I thought you couldn't ruin my life anymore. What in the world were you thinking? Holy crud! It's prisoner X! Oh, well, I think they... you've clearly lost your mind. She is bad news. Actually, no, she is way worse than bad news. Sorry, Warden. Zara and I made a deal. Did you know she was once an admin, too? The admin had to take her powers away. She tried to destroy him. I promised the admin I'd never let her free, no matter what. And I'll keep that promise. <gasps> Even if I need to blow us all up to do it. <sighs> No. Later, Tate. Oh, he just snatched it. <laughs> Why are you all staring at me? It's making me uncomfortable. So is it true what he said about you? 
You were an admin? Well, ugh, it's complicated. We want answers, Zara. Uh, fine. Yes, I was an admin. Ages ago, Romeo took my admin powers away from me just before he banished me to this pitiful prison. But I'm not the villain here. Romeo and his little warden were the ones who put you down here, not me! So glare in another direction! I'm innocent! You're just another victim of the admin. Just like the rest of us. And there will be a lot more victims if he isn't stopped. Soon. She's not like us. She's a monster. Wait, so an admin can be stripped of their powers? Ugh, it's not simple, but yes. So what do we... We don't have time for this. It won't be long before Romeo finds out what's happened down here. Yeah, I guess we should keep moving. Yeah, we just should probably run for it. Sorry, Jesse. But do you really trust her? She's not right in the head. Jack, you haven't seen what the admin can do. We need all the help we can get. But her? Really? Do you have any other ex-admins in your inventory? No. Oh. Petra's right. We need Zara's help. It's the only way. I just hope you're not making a serious mistake getting involved with another admin. I hope not. Romeo did always love creating new nightmares at every opportunity. Ah, run! Yep. Stay ahead of you. Seriously, what's with these monsters? They're all glowing. They're pretty scary looking, Jesse. Let's be scarier. My game froze. Okay, I couldn't figure out what was happening. We're playing. <laughs> we're tossing the spiders around. Never just one. Never. I hit it. Impressive. Less talking, more stabbing. They are everywhere. Ow. Okay. I should have waited for stamina. I shouldn't have rushed it. Uh, Zara? Thanks, I guess. Oh, come on, not the llama! <laughs> it's spitting its eye. The llama just do a power bomb on it? Jesse! Radar! Give me a boost! <laughs> Got it! Oh, hit that! I went to go get a drink! I took my hands off the controller for a second to get a drink. Get out of here! Ha! Nice shortcut. Come on. I tell you what, she is as crazy as a hopped up ocelot. Oh yeah. I don't even know what that means. Before we, there's got to be a way. Uh, Zara, 
You are right there? Just... No! Shut up and let me think! See? I told you we shouldn't have trusted her. She's lost. I said just let me think! Think or make something up. It's fine. Even if there's a setback, we can still get out of this. Not exactly a vote of confidence, but I'll take it. Wait! We can just build to the top of the wall and get to the other side that way! Yeah! Sounds good to me. We got a dirt bridge. Or dirt staircase. that Guys, don't come up here what why <laughs> oh okay got it it's got a rapid fire okay headed gas why would the admin create that I don't know. I'm guessing it's going to take three hits, though. Oh, it called in reinforcements. Oh, it's got a spot on its head. I bet I have to stab it there. We hit it with the rapid fire. We just keep on deflecting them. Ah! Uh, it's called in the horde. Oh, did we get it? It's rapid firing around. Oh, they're shooting him. Damn, I need to be careful. Those ones hit me. I'm down to three hearts. What's going on? Okay, we got it. I think we got it. I think that's its weak point. We gotta hop across the ghast. Get it! Just keep on stabbing it. Oh, X. I was mashing A for some reason. I hurt. Everything hurts. And you stuck the landing. Nice. Oh, that? It's just my perfect reflexes and photographic muscle memory. Well, there it is, guys. Our ticket out of here. That is sparkly. The sparkliest. Is that... Diamond? A lot of it. Where is everyone? That lunatic is gonna be inventory if she's not careful. So? We should lend her a hand, shouldn't we? But 
She sounds like she's in trouble. We're not abandoning her. I told her I'd help her escape. It's time to prove it. Let's do can't this. Leave her? Come on. Oh, I can't believe we're doing this. That's the hole that we blasted in earlier, Jack. Oh, she's got a spider on her back. Zara, come on! You came back. I said I'd get you out, didn't I? Now show us the way. I know you didn't have to do that. I appreciate it. Let's go. Radar, pick it up. I'm not a very trusting person. Romeo betrayed me. I have trouble getting along with others. I'm not much of a people person anymore. If I ever really was, it's gone now. You've been away a while. You'll figure out how to get along with people again. Doubtful. After what I've seen. There's something else you should know. There was a third admin named Fred. Where is he? Dead. He and I fought Romeo for control of the world. We lost. Okay. For a minute there, I thought we were going to have a major player. Yeah, how are we supposed to escape? This doesn't even go up that far. That's because we're not going up. We're going down. Down? There is no down. We're standing on bedrock. You can't go any lower. You might think so, but that's where we need to go. Below the bedrock. Everybody knows there's nothing under the bedrock except nothing. And also certain death. I really do want to believe you. Then believe me. I'd rather take my chances in the maze than listen to any more of her lies. Any of you are welcome to join me. That's crazy talk. All those monsters? I don't care. She's an admin. An admin killed Boss. Then stole his identity. And then... Remember I told you he took my admin powers away? Well, down there lies the secret to taking Romeo's powers from him forever. Fred, the third admin, discovered it. Jesse, help me dig through this tower. Come on. See? I told you. These stairs lead to our salvation. Now there's a good reason to get a move on. There's something below the bedrock. Or technically, hear me out on this. You used to be able to do something in uh, Minecraft where you could force yourself in the nether above the bedrock ceiling and then you could build on top of the nether. Maybe that's what this is. What was that? Was that like a massive Enderman? Also, I'm pretty sure this is the end of the episode. Yep, 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 it is. It is. Let's see if we got a episode preview here. Or next episode. It's the admin in my skin. I can't let anyone run around disguised as me or my friends. The amount of chaos they could cause is, well, it's unthinkable. That's why I summoned you. Summoned? Who, who is this? Track them down. Make sure they're behaving themselves. <laughs> Man, oh jeez. Run, 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 Jesse. As fast as you can. <laughs> okay. So we got like a ninja hunting us now. Alrighty, that's fun. Um, but I guess this is this is it for this episode. So if you guys have found yourself at any point enjoying it. 
please do remember to leave a like and also subscribe. And also remember to ring that notification bell so that way you guys can be notified upon me posting new videos. And yeah, this has been Gunshy Mori signing off. Peace.